Hello. It is menu planning Saturday and um, we have Xfinity out right now because since we lost power last Saturday night until Sunday morning, 13 hours, we've had no phone line and we have a landline because my mom wants to have a landline and it's been out and the technician has been here almost three hours and he has no idea why. So yeah, that's been my morning so far. Really afternoon because it's almost two o'clock when I'm making this video. Um, so yeah, but enough about that. Let's get into what we're gonna have for dinner this um, upcoming week. And I have my phone on cinematic because it tones down this really strange stormy light we have outside, but anyway. Um, we have one rollover, and that is crock pot chicken fajitas with yellow rice and corn. Um, just didn't get made. No reason. Just wasn't chosen. Um, because I made the barbecue chicken pasta salad, and that makes so much food for lunches and dinners. So, um, I was able to skip a meal, and the fajitas are what was skipped. So, I have on the list crock pot hamburger helper, which... Um, I've made before and I filmed it so if you were to scroll back because I don't have playlists but if you were to scroll back you'll find um, a video of me making that as well as crock pot uh, creamy French onion dressing chicken with um, roasted potatoes and green beans and also mashed potato bowls which are like KFC bowls, except we started making them before we knew what a KFC bowl was, like a bazillion years ago. Sorry, my alarm clock went off. My mom hurt her thigh and um, I set the alarm clock for icing and heating, so it just went off. But anyway, um, yeah, mashed potato bowls are like KFC bowls, um, but we don't use gravy, so yeah. <laughs> And then um, ham and cheese sliders with chips and fruit. And then our two nights of leftovers. So yeah, that's what's on the menu this week. And um, I already know things are going to start getting wonky because we're heading into that time of year where there's like seasonal events like for trick-or-treating and Halloween and before you know it, Thanksgiving and Christmas. And this is when I make a menu plan and I try to hold fast to it but we just do the best we can. Um, so yeah. So that's the story. Um, I hope you're doing well. I hope your weekend is less eventful than mine. I hear my husband talking to the technician right now and it sounds like they still have no idea what's going on. So I'm going to head out to the living room and see what's happening. All right. I hope you're doing well. I hope you had a good week. I hope you're having a really, really good weekend, and I'll talk to you later.